Hi guys, Jonathan from SpaceIL, and today I wanted to explain to you a little bit about the trajectory corrections that we did and will do, and how do they work. So if this is our spacecraft, here at the bottom we have a rocket engine that we can fire it to give the spacecraft an extra push on its way to, uh, to the moon, and I want to explain to you how does it work and how do uh, we work with this. So if this is Earth, and our spacecraft is going around and around the Earth, uh, in this orbit, this was the first orbit, and we want to get to here where the moon is going to be to capture with it. Uh, how do we do this and how do we plan our trajectory correction to do that? I have a really good friend, Oded, that gave me a really nice analogy and I want to show you uh, how does it work. So in the analogy, we we're going to look at a swing. And this is a st special type of swing. Uh, it never slows down. So you go around, you go back and forth, Oded goes back and forth, back and forth, and never slows down. And Oded want to reach over here, uh, to the moon. So uh, what can we do uh, if his mom or dad is around? Uh, it can give them. It can. They can give them an extra push, like over here, and Odell would come here, and they would just the right moment push them away, and then they they would increase their orbit and get all the way to the moon. The same thing works over here. So the spacecraft is going around and around, never slowing down. And there's a special point just about here where we're closest to the Earth, just around here that if we give the spacecraft an extra, an extra push with the rocket engines over here, we can increase the orbit. So this is what actually is going to, we are actually doing. The spacecraft goes around and around in this orbit, and at the right moment we fire the engines and give it an extra push to get it all the way to the moon. The problem is uh, the spacecraft is full with fuel and its engines are not very strong. So it's not like your uh, mom and dad are giving you a push, but let's say another, your, one of your siblings or brothers or sisters. So we cannot do this in a single push to get all the way to the moon. We have to give multiple pushes uh, uh, and push a few times to increase our orbit and, and all the way to the moon. So in this case, we're going around and around. We get an extra push that would get us to a higher orbit, let's say this orbit. And then we go around and around in this orbit. We do an extra push. And the third one is going to be the one that's going to get us to the right altitude to capture with the moon. So the first two already happened, and the third one is going to happen the week after the next. So cross your fingers, we're really working for this to work.